How to use Siri shortcuts to scan barcodes. Mary has Mac Hilda generation and enjoys listening to her CD collection. However, she struggles when reading the titles of her CDs. And the only way she knows for sure that she's got the right disc is by putting it into her CD player and playing the first track. In this video, we'll show how Mary can use her iPhone, Siri, and Seeing AI to tell her what CD she is holding. First of all, what is Seeing AI? Seeing AI is an app developed by Microsoft that uses artificial intelligence to recognize text, currency, phrases, and products, and then speaks the result to you. If you don't already have Seeing AI installed, you need to download it from the App Store. VoiceOver will announce it as Scene AI Talking Camera. So I've already got Scene AI installed on this phone. So the first thing I'm going to do is navigate to it. Scene AI. And then double I'm tap to open. And then I'm going to double tap. Scene AI menu button. And VoiceOver announces that the menu button is already selected. If it wasn't, I could find this in the top left-hand corner. Button. So I'll double tap on that. Close button. And then I'll navigate down to settings. Browse help feedback settings button. And I'll double tap. Back button. So now the settings menu is opened. And what I'm going to do is, I will swipe right until I get to Humphrey Hill Siri Shortcuts. Settings. Currency. Configure Siri Shortcuts. Button. And then I double tap. Select the activities which you wish to use with Siri Shortcuts. Heading. And in this case, I'm going to choose Recognize Product. So again, I swipe right until VoiceOver says recognize product. Recognize short, recognize, recognize pro, recognize person, recognize product. And then I double tap. Edit and shortcuts button. So the default phrase is, hey Siri, recognize product. But I don't want to use that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to swipe right until I get to change voice phrase. Image. Hey Siri. Recognize product. Shortcut added. Change voice phrase. Button. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to double tap. I'm going to say, what is this? Siri will then beep and insert that as my phrase for this shortcut. What is this? Inserted what is this? Now I can swipe right until I reach done. Short change voice phrase. Done. Button. Selected. Recognize product. So I'm now back in the Siri shortcut menu. I'm going to navigate to the back button in the top left hand corner to return back to the settings menu. Back. Button. Back. Configure Siri shortcuts. Button. Again, I'm going to navigate back to the back button to get back to the main screen. Cur back. Button. Menu. So now I'm going to come out of Seeing AI. So now let's see what happens when I ask Siri to tell me what this CD is. So we've got a CD here. Hey Siri, what is this? Now, at the moment we can't hear anything. And that's because there's no barcode visible. If I turn the CD over. Andrew Lloyd Webb close button. And because it's immediately announced it to me. 
if I place my finger at the bottom of the screen. Andrew Lloyd Webber, Phantom of the Opera slash show, C, R, C, D. Then voiceover will read out what the CD is. The nice thing about this is, is that you don't have to worry too much about getting the barcode in the right place. As long as the phone can see it, it will actually, it will actually scan it. So Mary can now scan her CDs using the barcode and her phone will announce the CD that she's listening to. If the barcode didn't exist, if, it, if the CD wasn't in the database, she could use the CNAI short text feature or the document feature which would read out the track listings to her. Of course she can also use this for other things, so if she's out shopping or if she's just looking for you know, a product in, in a cupboard at home, then she can also use that to scan the barcodes on that as well. However, for CNAI to work, you do need to have an internet connection. So I will be doing a, a fuller video on CNAI and all the other features, so stay tuned for that. We hope you found this video helpful. If you did, then please hit the like button and consider subscribing to our channel to find out when we create new videos. If you'd like to learn more about Cytairdale, then please visit our website or join us on Facebook.